Are you ready for the most low budget intro to a song out of these videos so far? Run at MGM, you know. One country that deserves a big round of applause, even for turning up at Eurovision this year, is Greece. When you consider it wasn't that long ago that their national broadcaster, the one which used to send all their songs to Eurovision and even hosted the competition in 2006, no longer exists, you would think they'd have an uphill struggle to get something to even show the competition, never mind organised national final. But Mad TV, uh, a national broadcaster, has taken on the challenge. And through that, they had a final where some very, very chart-friendly stuff was in the running. And the winner was Rise Up uh, with uh, Freaky Fortune featuring Risky Kids. Oh, yes. Get up and lose your mind, lose off your feet and fly. And this means we now have a song with a very long, almost funeral march intro, followed up by lots of people saying Rise Up. Lots and lots and lots and lots of times. And then after people have stopped saying rise up lots and lots and lots and lots of times, we then get a bit of a rap. By uh, Risky Kid. Saying that, it sounds like I'm saying it's rubbish. It's not. It's actually works together quite well. It, it's quite a pleasing mix, as I believe is what people say when they're describing rap music. It works well. You could imagine this on Radio 1, to be honest. Not many songs this year you can say that about. And it has its, its own little charm. However, it is so repetitive. I don't know if somebody hearing this for the first time will get it, or if they'll go, could they not think of any more lyrics to put to this? The one thing it does remind me of is the last Eurovision I attended in person was in Oslo in 2010. And in the run-up to it, nobody was given the French entry by Jesse Matador, uh, much hope. However, as soon as that came on in the arena and he started singing, the crowd around me just woke up. You had some women getting on their chairs and dancing to it because it just sounded like the type of stuff you'd hear on mainstream radio. You have to appreciate that everybody studies national finals closely and thinks that somebody who's had 25 goes to represent their nation finally gets there, that that's going to be enough to see them do well at the competition. Some people just want to hear about a song that they think ticks the boxes for them, and I think this could for people who just tune in on the night. So I will say Greece sailing through, I hate the word space sailing through to the final, Greece will get through to the final, and I can see them finishing quite safely inside the top 10 when they're there. But I don't think this is a top five. I just don't quite think it's different enough uh, to earn itself a place there. Seven.